This truck must have gone off the road shortly after the nuclear accident, and no one's gone to the trouble of removing it. Helen, follow the path of despair. This voice in my head is different from the hallucinations I've had in the past. Someone's really calling out to me. Iodine pills. Great. Since the radiation level is high in this area, I'd better take them soon. Radioactivity is highest in this direction. So this is the path of despair. So that's where the famed Dracula is hiding. As I get closer, I hear more and more voices.
Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I'll have to be careful. Only one of these passages will lead me to Dracula. I could use these cannonballs as decoys to detect traps. If I'm not mistaken. You've chosen the right path, Ellen. But now, you'll have to pay to cross.
Hello. Over here. I'll have to stay calm. He's playing with me. You're right. I'm playing with you. But will you really be able to stay calm? I'll try. That's brave, Helen. In any case, it was about time. I really thought that your strength would fail you before you could make it here. Why were you expecting me? My dear, that's not the right question. I just knew that you would come. And what have you come so far to find? Don't tell me that you're here to prevent the Shadow from getting a hold of my wife's blood. You know it's not true. No. You could have come here for any number of reasons. Curiosity. Getting away from it all. Wanting to find the one who betrayed you. I couldn't care less about him. Good. You'll be happy to learn that he's at my mercy. He got trapped in the limbo that you were able to avoid. I want you to recover my portrait. He brought it. You want your portrait, the one I restored. And what can you offer me in exchange? You've got some nerve. Well, what would you like? You're right. That's your survival instinct talking. I'll think about it. For the time being. Obey! Bring me my portrait, Ellen. Get me out of here. Oh? Then why should I help you? I'm sorry. I needed the painting. But it doesn't mean I wasn't sincere with you. How can you say that? One of your henchmen tried to kill me. He acted on his own initiative. I never wanted you to die. I don't believe you. Give me the portrait, now. So he's the one who sent you? Precisely. If you get me out of here, you can have the painting. But beware, Ellen. Once he has what he wants. As far as that's concerned, he's obviously just like anyone else. And we're gonna die anyway. I'll die because of my illness. You'll die because of the radiation you've been exposed to since your arrival. And I haven't even gotten to the child yet. The child? I'm pregnant, Adam. Our child will die here with us. We can't let that happen. Don't be silly. We can't do anything about it. Help me to get out of here. I'll give you the portrait and prove that you're wrong. There's still hope. I'll get you out of here, Adam. But don't kid yourself. Neither of us will get out of here alive. The blood of Lilith can save us, Ellen. Trust me.
now. For centuries, the order you belong to tried to conquer or bribe me. What makes you think you'll succeed where your ancestors have failed? I bring you your mirror, Prince, as well as the sweetest of company. She looks like her, doesn't she? You couldn't help but notice. And she needs you. True, you're right. She really does look like her. You're clever, Adam. I might make you one of my children, but you'll never drink my wife's blood. So give it to her. You won't go through eternity alone. I'll spend eternity however I want to. Unless your days are not. You shouldn't have. You saw me through the painting, didn't you? Yes, but you already knew that. For a long time, this painting was the last window through which I could see the world. Then crazy old Vambery put tar on it. So, I had his collection stolen. You could have just recovered the portrait, discreetly stolen it from the professor's home, couldn't you? That's probably what I would have done if Stoker hadn't come. He would have taken advantage of the situation to track the thief and put my loyal children in danger. But finally, you're the one who found Yannick and the portrait. And it's probably not a coincidence. Why did you choose this place? Men's madness has put this region at the intersection of two worlds. It's a place where darkness and light come together. Where I feel at home. And where your kind don't come to disturb me. Yannick says that no vampire can rival you. Oh, Yannick's an artist. He can take something appalling and make it sound. Elegant. But he's right. None of them can do anything to hurt me. Also, none of you would be able to save me from the ill that's eating away at me. I don't understand. Ellen, I was a prince. But I now only reign over the darkness and the rats that infest it. I am weary. You and your friend Stoker are so uh, entertaining. You've killed him? No, no. He's yours, as promised. But you should be worrying about your own fate. Your last bit of strength is failing you. Die soon. Adam was right. You remind me of someone who was very dear to me. The time has come for me to share my curse. Ellen, I'm offering life for you and your child, but I'm also offering you a life of darkness. The choice is yours. decided to turn down Dracula's gift. The Prince of Darkness will remain the one and only master of the undead. Your existence comes to an end here, unless... 